Hey everyone! So today's video I thought I would do the what's in my bag video um, because it is night time um, and I'm a little bit bored so I figured what better to do than film a video, right? I've been contemplating on doing this for a while but I figured that I would go ahead and do it today. Um, also, before we get started, I want to apologise if you hear any music in the background. My dad is listening to some music, so, yeah, that's that. So I'm sorry about that, um, but we'll work with it. So I'm just going to start off by showing you my bag first. And this is a bag that I have. It is a Kardashian bag. This is the one I find goes with every outfit and stuff. So I'll show you a close-up. I'm sure you've probably seen this before, but... That's what it looks like. It's just a nice um, brown grey nude with nice gold details like these gold studs and the Kardashian thing there and it did come with an extra gold um, long handle that you could carry it with but I only use that like when I go out clubbing and stuff but just for every day this is how I use it. Um, my mum bought this for me. She paid $100 for it. I got it from Strand Bags. Um, it's a store, a handbag store here in Australia. They sell like travel stuff and all of that as well. And yeah, that's where my mum got it for me from. Um, and yeah, I got it like, well, pretty quickly after it first came out, like within the first week or something, I, I was like, oh my god, I'm in love with this bag, I need to have it. And my mum, lovingly enough, got it for me. And I'm very happy with it. Um, when it first, when I first got it, it, it didn't used to sag like this in the middle. It used to be like all nice and up and everything. But now with all of the weight, I've had it probably for about a year now, and it's like sunk in, which is pretty annoying. But in the interiors, how about that? It's a black interior, and it's like the zips and stuff are nude, and it has okay, not gonna be able to see that, but it has like kegs on it which is really nice and in the front it has two little pockets there I normally keep my phone in this pocket but my phone's on the dresser right now um, and then it has two compartments with the zip dividing it I'm not showing this very well it's got two compartments so one compartment there and one compartment behind it and with a zip in the middle and a back zip as well so quite a few compartments in this little thing, which is great because you can carry so much. And even on a night out, I carry this bag and it's totally fine. I have not organized this bag in any way that like, so that it looks nice and presentable. I'm just going to show you however it looks because that's how I keep it. I'm going to start in the front and work my way back. So the front two pockets, I have a Kleenex pack of tissues. Just dry tissues for on the go. And I have a cold liner. This should be in my makeup bag in here or zip or whatever, but it's not. So this is the Iconic cut, um, Cold Pencil. It's waterproof, no smudge, 10 hours stay and dermatologically tested. I have no idea where I got this from. Probably stole it off my mum. But yeah, I have that in there as well. Just putting things back slowly as I'm going. Oh, look at that. I also have a USB stick in there, don't know if it has anything on there, but that's all that's in the front pocket. The first zip, oh my hair. In the first zip I have my wallet, this is um, from Strand Bags as well, it's the brand Bluebird. If you live in Australia you know what brand I'm talking about, but that's that. It's just a nice black glossy wallet with like a press down thing and I have some cash in there and some cards and stuff in there. So that's that. Then I have a pack of Kleenex wet wipes because you know whenever you're eating out or something and you need to wipe your hands with something wet, there you go. And I have my sunglasses. My mum got me this case. I know, my mum gets me like everything. So she got me this sunglass case which is the brand Shades and Style and it's a nice dusty gold colour which is so pretty. And these are my sunglasses. I have no idea what brand this is. My mum got this for me too. My mum should be doing this video. Um, but yeah, that's what they look like. Hey, you can see me in the reflection. And this is a side detailing. So that's what my sunnies look like. Very, very fashionable. 
So that's all in my front pocket. Then in the middle zip, I only have one thing I think, isn't it? Yeah, and it is a Megaga Professional Beauty um, pouch and it's really cute. Um, my mum got this for me from the markets, like either Belmont Markets or Canning Bell Markets. And it's just a really, really inexpensive brush set that she got me. It folds over like this so you're protecting your brushes when you close them up. And you just have a face brush, an eyebrow, eyebrow brush, some, um, a flat shader brush, a crease brush, an angled brush, another small brush and another flat shader brush. So great for on the go. I do, I do get a lot of use out of this like when I actually go out and stuff and I need to touch up through the night or whatever. Um, I do get use out of that. The back pocket, I have, this is really, really dirty. It's because one of my eyeshadow palettes um, broke in here. It what That's what happens when you don't put your uh, makeup in its makeup bag. It will shatter. But this is the Calvin Klein Into You um, sample perfume. I don't really like this. Um, I use the Flash by Jimmy Choo. Um, my fiance got that for me for my birthday. It's an advanced birthday present. Um, but my mum had this and she got it in full size, so I was like, oh, I'll just throw that one in my bag. So it is nice. I do use it if it is if I really do need it. What else is in here? I have my little makeup pouch that's just hot pink and it's glossy and it's got two bows on it. I don't really keep much like touch up makeup. Um, just because I don't really touch up that much but one of the most important things that I do touch up is powder and this is the Australis pressed powder um, in the shade deep natural 46001 and it has a little mirror in it as well and yeah starting to hit pan on that because I do use it when I go out a lot because I have very oily skin and then I have the Revlon lipstick in 025, which is Carnation. That's it. Right there. And that's what it looks like. It's just a nice hot pink colour like that. I don't really use it because I wear nudes more, but it stays in there. And I have the Boing by Benefit... Um, Concealer. I've had this for a very, 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 very long time. Probably needs to be thrown out. I'm in the color one. Um, yeah, that's what it looks like. It's really, really dirty right now. In my last pocket at the back, I have a copy of my house key. I have a um, balm for when I get headaches. As you all know, I probably, I think I suffer from migraines. Another Kleenex tissue thing in there because I'm a freak like that. And another USB stick in there. And that's it guys. That's all that's in my bag. Well, there's probably a lot of junk. But yeah, I thought that I would share that with you guys. It's actually really fun to film this. So yeah, please like, comment and subscribe to me. And I will talk to you guys soon. If you have watched this video, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I cannot say it enough. And I'll see you guys soon. Bye.